So how long have you been walking? Oh, I started on October 29th. Right, yeah. And uh, I take, yeah, about four months. <laughs> we nearly there. I know. When the Tiaroa Tramper arrives in the South Island's Queenstown, the trail hits what's called a hazard zone. Lake Wakatipu is in the way, and the road around it is narrow and windy with no shoulder and lots of gawking tourists. The only safe thing to do is to get a ride around the lake. Well, not anything. But it's at this point a tramper can decide to add a few extra days. And rather than head straight to the Greenstone track where the TA continues, she can walk on a great walk, meeting the official trail later. I got to the start of the great walk, the root burn, in two rides, camping in rain, and not sure I'd manage the 20 miles in wet, sloppy conditions. You see, it's kind of awkward to know, as a thru-hiker, exactly when you'll be somewhere. So the huts on this very popular trail are usually sold out when you arrive. That means you have to walk it all at once, all in a day hike. But great walks have gorgeously groomed tracks. The walking was easy. Gloomy skies added drama, overflowing rivers added thrill. But I have to say, I get nervous in wet and cold. I'm nervous I'll succumb to a chill and shiver with hypothermia. So I ask a ranger what it will take to camp. And he quotes me $135 for a bunk, plus a $50 fine. But I'd have to sleep on the floor. I definitely don't want it that badly. So I keep walking as the trail comes to rock, a bit slippery, but so well manicured it seems that every rock has a flat, stair-like surface. And yeah, I'm moving fast to complete the circuit in a day, but I'm also three months plus into a through hike and I'm the most fit of my life. And the views, I mean, now I'm in a giant bowl of rushing water, hundreds of waterfalls lining the cliffs and racing down to meet in the center. The wind just lashes at my face. I go up and over to a beautiful lake now. The dramatic peaks above wink at me through the mist. The sky isn't blue, the air isn't calm, but this moment still fills me with wonder, perhaps more in its natural state of stormy indifference. It's dangerous and inhospitable, even if striking to see as I pass through, lingering temporarily before desiring the safety of shelter. The walk is long and cold, sidling a ridge. I meet a French family who dresses their little girls in plastic garbage bag raincoats. The views open up some of glaciers nestled in dark spires. A massive waterfall is thrown like a rope in a hurricane, soaking me to the skin. In time, I reach a lake and leave the trail for a backcountry hut where the fire is blazing and the smiles shared easily. I claim the last bunk, thrilled with my trail detour, the effort and the drama. This audio narrative is supported by John Reamer & Associates, a private wealth advisory practice of Ameriprise Financial Services Incorporated, located in Minnesota with 30 years of experience. Thanks, John.